Welcome to WoW Basic Training. Uh, today we're going to be talking about 7.1.5 and the catch-up mechanic that was introduced to get you caught up on your artifact research notes, your artifact research level. Uh, anyone who's been playing since launch is probably going to be at artifact level 25. You see that in the tooltip there, artifact knowledge level 25. Um, and if you're over a certain artifact research level, like I think it's 20, you can catch up your alts up to 20 artifact knowledge uh, using this new mechanic. And what it's a lot, what it's intended to do is make the game a little bit more alt friendly because from what I understand, the subscription numbers are really, really low, uh, you know, suffering because of how all unfriendly Legion has been for alts, especially, and how unfriendly it's been for, um, you know, doing multiple specs. Once you get into one spec, you feel like you're locked in until you get at least higher artifact research levels. So it's a cascade effect. Now, the way this works is they've taken these, uh, you know, the lore and legends type of uh, NPCs in every order hall, the ones that you use to research your artifact knowledge. And of course, you know, this is going to be different in every order hall. You have, you have this guy, and you notice how now instead of having the little research tooltip like you have with this guy, like a training thing, you see how the tooltip is a, is a book. It's now a bag, which means he's a vendor. And so what you end up with now is you have, uh, the, you know, because I'm level 25, I can't do any more research. So, uh, I, and I know on the tunes that, uh, where I'm not 25 yet, but I'm over 20, he's both a vendor that sells these things. And he has the little notepad or note page icon here instead of the bag icon there it has a little note page icon you know like i'd like to continue researching my um you know my artifact so you know of course this guy at, this is one of the only ones that has an actual dialogue uh, as well so this guy's got three options he's always had at least two with the dialogue and the research um prior to 25 i would imagine he has the dialogue the the vendor option and the research option so anyway this tooltip has um a little bit of confusing language to it the artifact research compendium volumes one through four and you're thinking one through four does that only get me the you know four levels of artifact knowledge um no it doesn't it it actually gets you up to 20. if you read the tooltip really carefully you will see it says okay will allow you to reach artifact knowledge level 20 when used in conjunction with all unused artifact research documents. Not usable if the pupil has already reached uh, 20 or more artifact research documents. Okay, so what does that mean? Now, first of all, in every single uh, um, order hall, you're going to have your research guy, the one that you've been doing your research at all along. He's going to be turned into a vendor as well as a work order NPC. You're just going to be given the option. Now I'm going to log out, and I'm going to show you my uh, my tunes here. Now I started out on launch day, you know, and the first week I started actually leveling two different tunes, my main and my uh, resto druid. Um, but I, within the first month, I had already leveled up probably four tunes up to 110. So they were all really up to date on their research uh, levels. So I have my Hunter, I got my Prot Pally, I got my Resto Druid, and I got my Holy slash Disc Priest, right? All of these guys at least had 23, if not 24 or 25 research levels already completed. So all four of these guys are pretty much complete. So none of them would qualify to use that compendium. Now, that compendium is bind, bind on account, of course, because it doesn't make sense to bind it just to your character, and it doesn't make sense to allow you to trade it to other players. The whole purpose of those is to trade it to or mail it to your alts. And so, for example, my Warlock, this is the example I'm going to use to explain exactly how it all works. My Warlock was Artifact Knowledge Level 5, and this is perfect for this, right? 
Um, artifact knowledge level five. Because some we had one guy who was level three. My D, actually my DK was level three, and I used a compendium on that one, and it put me up to level eighteen. Now consider this: I had two artifact knowledge work orders already working, and they had already been committed. So, looking back at that compendium, uh, looking back at the uh, the tooltip, it said in conjunction with all unused research notes. Well, I'd already started two work orders, so it only gave me fifteen uh, item or research levels, right? So, as you can see here, I'm at 20 now, but I was at 5 on this tune. And I was like, well, you know, if it only gave me 15 on my DK, maybe that's what that means. It went from 3 to 18. But I had fa failed to consider that I had two, uh, two uh, work orders already going. Now, on my Warlock, I had two work orders going, but the night before, I had used the, uh, com the Companion app on my phone to collect a uh, work order so i had one in my bags you know and i had two work orders going and i was level five what that means is i had three unused research notes going on i had one that i could use right now and two that were pending in the work order queue so when i used the compendium on this tune it brought me from five to seventeen and that's what people are a little confused by like i thought it would bring me to twenty well, uh, I had one completed work order, uh, you know, that I hadn't collected. I had one completed work order that I had collected and another work order that, um, I think it was, uh, you know, a couple hours away from being collected. So I had one in my bags, one completed at the work order vendor, I think, and a, one that was like, you know, half a day away or something like that. Uh, I can't remember exactly what. But you see here now, we go into, uh, you know, the war Warlock area, and um, we have the, uh, there's the class hall upgrades guy, and here's the head archivist. And you see how he has, he's got a page to continue research, and now on this tune, I can buy the compendium, right? One through three. And this one allows me to re reach artifact level knowledge 15. So 1 through 4 is up to 20. 1 through 3 is up to 15. So I'm guessing there's other ones, you know, with volumes 1 through 2, which allows you to get up to 10 if you are less than, you know, 20. So you see how that works. But you go back in here and uh, let's continue the research. And then now he becomes a work order guy, right? So I already have two work orders going. My cooldown is two days, still. Um, so yeah, they've converted this this NPC into a dual purpose NPC. But that should give you an a, an idea of how it works. When you use the compendium, <clears throat> it takes into consideration any uh, completed artifact knowledge notes in your bags. <clears throat> it also takes into consideration any and all current work orders that you have going on the work order guy so if you have one work order going and nothing in your bags and you use a compendium that's one through four it'll bring you up to 19 because it's taking that into consideration that one work order on the work order dude uh it'll bring it doesn't matter where you start it'll bring you up to basically 20 minus the number of work orders and completed uh notes in your bags so it's kind of complicated a little bit confusing but rest assured that you when you are done with everything that's currently active in the game as far as research notes are concerned you will have 20 it'll get you there faster so it is an acceleration mechanic <clears throat> that uh you can use and uh yeah i hope this has helped so good luck have fun hit that like button and subscribe and uh i'll see you next time